guys i am so 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 very excited to be with you here today now today is a very 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 special day oh oh i'm so excited so 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 excited it is easter sunday yeah 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 easter sunday and today Pastor Dana and Mr. Hunter were so, so, so nice that they let me, they let me do the opening for our video. Okay, well, actually, uh, maybe that isn't, uh, exactly, uh, what, uh, happened. You see, what had happened was I wanted to do the opening so, so, so bad. And they said, no, 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 no. You can't do it, Carl. No. That's what they told me. And so you guys want to know what I did to get to do the opening? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm going to tell you. So while Mr. Hunter and Pastor Dana were sleeping, I was spying. Yep, I was spying. You guys know, I was a spy once. Yep, all those spying techniques are sure coming in handy. Anyways, I was spying on them last night. And while they were sleeping, I took a bunch of Mr. Hunter's stinky, stinky, stinky socks and I tied them together to make a big rope and I took that rope and you guys know what I did with it I tied them up <laughs> I tied them up so that I could do the video for today yep now that is how I am here this morning that is why it is me I tied them up because they told me no yuck so now now that we're here celebrating this special, special day, this special, special Sunday, I figured we should start with a game. Now, I know that your series, the name, the name, name of our series is Walking in Victory. Now, when we think about victory, we think about all sorts of sports. Sports, 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 like uh, 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 football and softball and uh, 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 soccer and basketball and puppet ball. Yep, puppet ball. That is a sport in puppet land and it is awesome. Yep, it sure is, sure is. It is lots and lots of fun. Maybe one day I will teach you how to play puppet ball maybe we'll play it in children's church once we get back into the building yeah 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 that will be so 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 exciting now anyways our theme is walking in victory and victory means to win to win 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 or to overcome overcome let's say that together overcome overcome yes or to overcome something that is difficult now if you have ever ever been to a sports game you know that there is lots and lots and lots of cheering that goes on now when I go to sports games I get very 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 excited See, I sometimes I act like this. Yeah! Woo oh, yeah, 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 go, go, go! Woo Something like that. And then, well, there are other times when uh, I sound like this. Boo! 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 Like that. Now. 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 I am going to play for you a sound of a real audience cheering. Here it is.
Now I'm going to play a sound of an audience booing. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. So you have cheering. Woohoo! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheering, and then you have booing. Boo! At a sports game, you might, might, just might hear sounds like that. So that is what our game is going to have to do with. And I'm going to be nice and I am going to untie Pastor Dana and Mr. Hunter so they can play this game with you. I'll see you later guys. Bye! Alright guys, well it took a little while for us to get untied. Carl tied us up pretty tight. He must have known some fancy knots. Maybe. Dude, yeah, it must have been all of his time he spent as a spy. Yes, that's what it was. He must have learned them in spy school. That's probably what it was. I wish he would have never yeah. learned those knots, let me tell you. Yeah, what. me too. Well, I don't know. Maybe he could teach me and I could tie Mr. Hunter I think I got, up when he's, I I you some know, rope burn. just going a little hoo hoo. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. It wasn't rope burn, they were socks. Sock burn. Sock burn. Whatever. Anyways, we are here to play a game with you today. Now, we're going to play a game. We've played this game before in Children's Church, but we're going to tweak it just a little, little bit. Mr. Hunter, let's show them what our game is called. It is... <laughs> Love it or leave it. Love it or leave it. Love it or leave it. Now, if you remember, we had played this game in Children's Church. In Children's Church, um, we would put, we, I put a picture on the screen and you would have to decide if it's something you love, you would run to one side of the room or you'd run to the other side of the room. Now, you can do that. You can, um, you can still run to either side of the room. Let's say that uh, this side will be the love it. And then this side over here. Oh, hold up. Did I do that right? My side will be love it. Mr. Hunter's side will be lead it, leave it if you want to do it that way. Or you can do it how Mr. Hunter and I are going to do it. So Carl was telling you about, we overheard him while he had us tied up. Um, he was telling you about at a sports game, you might hear some people cheering, woohoo! Or you might hear some people booing, boo! You might hear some of this noise at a sports game. So once we put up a picture we're going to be doing easter candy that's we're going to do, be doing this round um or this game this game is going to be easter candy if you love the easter candy make a cheering sound mine's going to be whoop 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 mr hunter what's yours going to be Woo! wow that's pretty good um and then we need a booing sound a sound if you don't like the candy mine's going to be Mine's going to be boo wow how original, Mr. Hunter. Hey, how hey, do you use right. Somebody so, had to do it. So you make a cheering sound. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Woo! <laughs> that, was, that was a little delayed, Mr. Hunter. We'll try this again. All right. You'll make a cheering sound. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Woo! Hey, that was good. You make a cheering sound or you'll make a booing sound. Arrk. Boo. Arrk. Boo. Arrk. Boo. Arrk. Boo. <laughs> that was good. All right, guys. So let's um give this a try. Fry. Sorry, I gotta find it. Just like Mr. Hunter couldn't find it earlier. Where? Okay, mm. here they are. <laughs> mm. All right, here we go. Remember, if you love it, you're gonna run to my side, or you're gonna make a whoop 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 sound, or a or whatever cheering sound that you wanna make. Or if you wanna leave it, if you don't like that candy too much, you're gonna run to Mr. Hunter's side, and you're gonna go or boo or whatever uh, booing sound that you want to make. So here we go. Here's our first candy. It is, oh, jelly beans. Jelly beans for me are whoop, whoop, whoop. Woo! Hey, all right. How about you guys? Do you love them or leave it? Would you rather have it or not? Hmm. All right. Our next candy is, what is this? Ooh. This is, I, oh, is it, oh, is it a this marshmallow is a, covered? This is a marshmallow, chocolate covered marshmallow yes. bunny. Woo! I love these things. Yes, Mr. Hunter loves them. He at Christmas time he likes me to get him the uh the Santa. they have they have Santa Claus ones and he always wants me to oh, get them as so for good. Christmas. So I good. didn't know they made them for Easter, so maybe I will uh see if they have still have some at the store Dude, for I Mr. Hope Hunter. So, I love so these for things. me these are, what are For they? me they're a big Woo! <laughs> Alright, our next candy is Oh peeps! Woo! Woo! We love peeps. We love peeps. Have they you guys our... tried the pancake and syrup ones? They're kind of weird tasting, but once you get past them, they're not bad. 
I didn't even know they had this kind. They that were a mystery good. flavor one year, but see, now they revealed it, and it's pancakes and Ah, stuff. see, I don't know about the mystery flavor ones. They're kind of like, yeah. I've had also, every kind of Pete known to man. I love these things. He does love Peeps. He's a Peep fanatic. I don't like the sour ones. Those are weird. The sour Peeps. The sour you, watermelon ones? Yeah, the sour watermelon. Oh, those are pretty like good. Those. They might be like, one of my favorites, argh, actually. Those are urg for me, but regular Peeps, Peeps in general are whoop, whoop, whoop for me. All right, next candy is... Oh, Reese's peanut butter eggs. Woo, 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 woo. I love those, and so does my mom. My mom loves those candies so much. Every every year for Easter. Uh, uh oh, I didn't get her any this year. Yeah. Pastor sorry, Dana. mom, if you're watching. Sorry. Uh, every year we usually get her some Reese's peanut butter eggs for Easter. She loves them so much. And she right. always gets the trees for Christmas. Yes, and we get her the Reese's trees, trees Christmas. for Christmas. These are so much better than regular Reese's cups because they're bigger. They're the best. All right, next we have Robin eggs. Woo! I don't like robin eggs. If you've never had robin eggs, they're like uh, whoppers. They're like the, almost the same thing as whoppers, except they have like a, like a, a candy, candy coating on the outside. So for me, these are a big, dark, leave it. Leave it for me, Mr. Hunter. Oh, they're big, woo, for me. Yeah. You know, Pastor Dan, I don't know that you got a candy in here that I'm going to make a boo noise for. I don't know. There might be, I think there will be oh, one. Oh, one? Okay. Yes. All right, All we'll right. find out. Here we go. The next candy is black licorice. Jelly beans. Arr! Woo! Are I you like serious? these things. Yeah, me and Dad eat these every year. I cannot. Stand. My grandma always puts them out on a little dish, and my dad and I eat them. Yeah. Really I did good. not like black licorice. Wait, is I this like... the one you thought I was gonna boo? Mm, maybe. There's oh, okay. kind of two. There might be one more that you might boo. All so right. for me, this is definitely a leave it. Boo! Arr! I would, I would scoop these suckers up in a hurry. Yuck. All right, here we go. The next one is. Oh my goodness. Sorry, I don't know if you can tell in the picture. It's a little tiny. I apologize about that. Um, these are the little cartons of bubble gum Easter Ooh. eggs. Yes, for me, that is a big woo, 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 woo. Woo. I love those. Those are my favorite. But I will say, when I first start chewing with them, I love them. Woo! But then after five seconds, they run out of flavor. Then they're a big arc. But I, agree. I still, but I, I, agree. I still love them. I still like them. All right, so for me, that's a love it. Mr. Hunter, love it or leave it? I love it. Love it. Cool. All right, here we go. Next one is, oh, Cadbury cream eggs. Um, boo. Uh, boo. Uh, uh, mm, boo. Some people are crazy about these, but I just. I'm not a fan. I don't really care for them. They're like. They have a weird taste. They're just okay. They're, you know what I mean? I wouldn't, I wouldn't really want them in my Easter basket. I wouldn't want them at all. Okay. That's good to know. Whether they're in okay. my Easter basket or not. Oh, okay. All right. But I would be yeah, I would be grateful if they're in my Easter basket. Let me clarify. I'll be grateful for oh, anything yes. that I got in my Easter basket. I agree. I would but also be grateful. if I was shopping for my own Easter basket, I wouldn't buy them. Agreed. There we go. All right. Here we go. Next we have, oh, the chocolate bunnies. Woo! -hoo 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 -hoo. Now, I, 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 have, I, I like these. I think they're weird because when you oh, bite into them, they're hollow on the inside. But I think that's what I like so much about Ooh, them. Some of them aren't hollow. Though. They have one. See, now. I don't like this. They're kind. the solid two dimensional. No. The cookies and cream one is where it's at. No, that's not what this is a picture of, though. This is okay. Well, hollow. I still, I still like this, this too. This is hollow. The one. hollow ones this are This one you break open, and you can tear his head off, and then you can stuff stuff in. And then his you can body. stuff black licorice jelly beans in there. Yuck. No, I love these. I like the the hollow ones are a big whoop 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 for me. They're good for me, Mr. Hunter. They're woo for me. Yeah, that was that was, I, that wasn't a very believable. Okay, fine. Duty. Woo! Okay. All right. Next we have. Okay, this is the one I wasn't sure Ooh. about. Coconut. Oh yeah, no. Filled mm -hmm. eggs. For me, that is a. Woo -woo 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 -woo. For me, that's a big boo. That doesn't sound very believable. Boo. Okay, that's kind of bad. Whoop whoop. I love these. These are something that I love. Mr. Hunter, when, Hunter wants to leave it. I want to love it. Dude, so, anything with coconut, if, guys, I'm not going to touch it. If you guys are looking to get us something for Easter, these would be great. A bunch of coconut-filled eggs, and then I can eat them all. Mr. Or Hunter you could get have. us a huge bag of black licorice jelly beans. No. No. Please don't do that. All right, next. Our next candy is... Oh, we're back to the beginning. We're back to jelly beans. Now, while we're talking about, well, we can just talk about jelly beans for a second. Um, I have a specific type of jelly beans that I like. Actually, there are two kinds of jelly beans that I like. Mr. Hunter, would you like to guess 
what uh, jelly beans that I like. Not flavors, brands. What brand jelly beans? Oh, what brand? Yes, what brand? Hmm. Starburst? Starburst. Starburst. Ding, Starburst? Ding, 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 ding. Okay. That's one. And. Hmm. Uh, Come on. Hmm. They're out year round, not just during Easter. Oh, okay. Is it the Brock's brand? Isn't that like a name brand of Did jelly beans? Did you just bean? make that up? No, I'm pretty sure it's I a think brand. you just made it up. Made it up. Come on. Jolly this Rancher. is like No, this is the classic jelly beans. Like when you think about jelly beans, this is should be jelly what bellies. you think of. Yes, okay. jelly bellies. I like jelly bellies and the Starburst. Those are my two favorite types of jelly beans. Well, Mr. Hunter, I thought that was pretty fun. That was a fun game. Love it. it. I enjoyed or it. leave it, love it or leave it. Whoop whoop whoop. Or Nerk. So most of the candy. Why are you laughing? Because you're hilarious. You laughing in my face? Yeah. That was a pretty Nerk. good one. <laughs> was that a good one? It was very good. Okay. Um so love it or leave it, that was a fun game. And uh I think is Carl coming back? Do you hear him? Oh. Hmm. Is that him? I think I do hear that annoying is sock him? coming. Mr. Hunter, he is not annoying. Okay, I'm sorry. I apologize. Wow. Carl is that, a level. That Carl hurt my a... heart. That hurt my heart, Hunter. Me and, me and Carl, we are very, very close friends. Oh, yeah, I know, because you guys very are always plotting friends. against me, and you always have Carl spying on me and trying to tie okay. me up with dirty socks. Yeah, well, Gosh. if you weren't uh, so mischievous, I wouldn't have to have him spying on you. I think you and Carl are the mischievous ones, and I'm the perfectly fine one. I am not mischievous. Never. Not one day in my life have I ever been mischievous. Shit. No, I haven't. Shit. No, ask her, I haven't. Ask, look, the next time y'all see Mr. Larry at church, you ask him if Dana was mischievous when she was little, and I guarantee his answer is yes. Okay. There might be this one time I played the greatest prank, the greatest prank on my dad ever, and it's so funny. He still talks about it to this day. It was the best prank ever. But anyways, that is another story for another day, but oh, I think Carl, Carl is coming up next, so uh, we will see you soon. Bye, guys. All right, so guys, we found Carl. Yes, yes, we did. But yes. I figured out why he sounded so funny. I figured out why I couldn't hear his voice right. We found him like this right here. He doesn't want to show. Oh, he Carl, want to come do it. on, bud. It's okay. On. It's okay. Maybe just for a second. Carl, what do you think? Okay, he agreed to just, All right, come just on for up, Carl. three seconds. Three right, seconds, you can see. Here, how I'll, count, I'll count him out for you, Carl. All right, here we go. One. Oh no, look at Two. Carl. Mr. Hunter must have done this to him. Three. Mr. Hunter. I gotta say, I'm enjoying this. Mr. Hunter right. tied him up. Hey, somebody. Sock. Somebody he had to get that chomp the... back. Hey, Carl is nice. He Carl tied both of us good, up and stole the opening friend. part of our video. Hey, good... He was just excited about Easter. Yeah, well, maybe you shouldn't have very, told him no so many times, excited. Pastor Dana. Well, maybe you shouldn't have told him no so many oh, times, Oh, I was Mr. all Hunter. on board hmm. for it. Oh, okay. Is that why you... Tied him up. Hey, he tied me up first. You were asking for it. He was asking for you it. You were asking for it. He's always spying on me. I had, to, I had to get him to stop somehow. Well, I don't think that this uh, this didn't change anything. He still has his eyes. He can still spy on you with his eyes. Isn't that right, mm. Carl? I'll rip his little sock See? puppet eyes Think off. Wow. Mr. Hunter. Mr. Hunter. Anyways, we better get back on track. Everybody tell Carl bye. Sorry, guys, he can't talk. Well, Mr. Hunter, you can tell him goodbye. Bye, Carl. Bye. See you later. Bye, uh, sock. All right, well, it. hopefully, hopefully Carl will uh, be able to get that sock untied off of his face. But now, so let's get back on track, back on track. So I hope it stays we, stuck on there for a while. That is very mean, Mr. Hunter. All right, now we're back very on track. Mean. Okay, back on track. Back on track. Are you ready? This I'm ready is, if you're this ready. is why you don't do children's church with this me. This is you're exactly a why. You're a distraction. Okay, anyways. Guys, I blame Carl. So, Carl, at the beginning, he was telling you about how when you're at a game, or even during our game, love it or leave it, um, sometimes we were cheering, whoop, 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 and then other times we were going, boo, 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 you know, stuff like that. Now, last week, if you remember back, if you think back to last week, um, Mr. Hunter, do you remember what you and Mr. Carl told us about, not Mr. Carl, <laughs> hmm. you and Carl told Me us about last Carl, week? and Carl, let's see, what did we talk think, about? Think, Mr. Hunter. Let's think. Here. Think, 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 hmm. think. Mr. Hunter. Oh, it's got to be something about Moses because we finished that up last week, right? So it's not Moses. We finished Moses up two weeks ago. Oh, two weeks wow. ago. So, ooh, last... Wow. Hold on. Let me wow. put my thinking cap on. Here. Yeah, you better. Shame on Mr. Man, Hunter. Put me on the spot. Hey, yeah. 
Let's see. Yeah, now he's looking oh, at my notes that are on the screen. He's looking see. at my notes. He's I cheated. bet yeah, we, what talked did we talk about, about Palm Sunday yes, Mr. and how, we put, how the Palm people put Sunday. the branches down. Yes. So yes. Jesus and his donkey didn't have to touch that dirty old Yes, dirt. yes, yes, yes. Last week we talked about Palm Sunday. And we talked about how Jesus, when he was entering Jerusalem, the people were celebrating. Whoop, 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 whoop. And they're waving palm leaves up in the air. Last week we talked about sports signs, how you might go to a sporting event and have a sign. You will wave it in the air. Ooh, ooh, cheering for your people. Um, well, the people in Jerusalem, they were uh, waving around palm leaves. They were excited. They were honoring Jesus. And do you remember what they were yelling, Mr. Hunter? Hosanna. Yes, they were yelling. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna. And Hosanna is a word of praise and it's a word of adoration and it's a word of joy. And so they were excited and they were honoring Jesus as he was coming into Jerusalem. Now, I told you at the end of last week that things were about to change. Now, at the beginning of the week, Mr. Hunter, on Palm Sunday, they were cheering for him. Whoop, whoop, yep. whoop. But then by the end of the week, those same people, they were they were the ones who were bringing Jesus down. They were boo. Well, they might have actually said boo, but they were saying mean things about Jesus. And by the end of the week, they were the ones who were shouting, crucify him, crucify him. At the beginning of the week, they were cheering for him. Whoop, whoop. But then at the end of the week, they were chanting, crucify him, which means they wanted them they wanted them to put Jesus to death so just in one week it went from something very drastic from a whoop 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 to a boo and in one week's time now we have a video that we're going to show you today um that picks up sort of where we left off with Palm Sunday we're going to see um how things changed and what took place on Good Friday and Easter Sunday so let's uh check this video out Wow, guys, that video is so powerful. You know, it shows us what Easter is truly about. I know just a little while ago, we played a game, Love It or Leave It. It was all about Easter candy. But, you know, Easter is so much more than that. It's bigger than the candy. It's bigger than the egg hunts. It's, it's about what Jesus did um, for us on the cross. And the story of Easter, the account of Easter that is found in the Bible, it is, it is the greatest love story that has ever existed. And what's so great about it is, is it's true. It's, it's a true love story about, about a genuine love, the most wonderful kind of love that um, has ever existed has ever existed and that's the love between God and us. God loves us so 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 much. You know the first time that I watched that video I was just sitting on my couch trying to, I was honestly just trying to figure out what God wanted me um, to talk about this morning and I had found that video and I watched it and it, it, um, it brought me to tears just thinking about what Jesus did for me. You know, he, he did that for me. He died on the cross for me. And he died on the cross for you. And he died on the cross for, for all of us. And as I watched that video, as I just sat on my couch and watched that video, you know, I I felt his presence in the room. And it was, it was a really, really cool thing. And um, my hope and my prayer is in this moment and in, and in the time that you're watching the video that you were overwhelmed with his love, his love for you too, and that you could feel um, his presence in, in, in a tangible way, a way that you could feel and experience his presence, and that you can even feel and experience his presence still right now. And um, I want to take this opportunity um, to spend some more time in God's presence. I just want to take a few minutes, and this is what I want you to do. Um, like I said, it was the greatest love story. Easter is the greatest love story that, that there ever has been and that there ever will be. And I want you to take time to, to love on God. Just worship Him and talk to Him and spend time with Him. And um, let Him love on you too. So um, let's take this time just to, to not be silly, but to, to be still in God's presence, you know, to, to talk to him, to worship him. And remember, this is a serious time, just like we do at Children's Church. Feel free to, to kneel on your couch or lay flat on your tummy. Sometimes we do that and just whatever you do, get the distractions away. Don't worry about the people that are beside you or, or your phones or anything else that might, um, might, might be a distraction, to, distraction for you. Um, but let's just spend this time with God.
hope you took that time um, to spend with God and just to love on Him and to thank Him for all that He's done for you, especially on this Easter Sunday as we think about you know how he he died for us on the cross but he he came became victorious over death and the grave and he came back to life and you know and he he showed us who who he truly is and the power that he really has and you know he's 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 a god who is worthy of our love and worthy of our praise and so so i hope that you took that time to just to love on him and that you got to experience god's presence again in your home guys it's so important for you to know that god's presence isn't just for at church in our prayer time you know when we come together and we have children's church and we have prayer time at the end it's great and it's amazing and there are times when we can feel god's presence in in a way that it's just hard to explain and it's awesome and it's great and we take time to pray over one another and um to pray for each other and guys i want you to know that that isn't just for children's church that isn't just for in the church building but it's for in your home too you know during these times of prayer that um, we, we will probably continue to do um, while we meet together online feel free to pray over one another kids you can pray for your parents parents you can pray for your kids you know um, use that opportunity to um, to to do what we're supposed to do you know the people us the people who go to church are actually the church the people who believe in jesus we are the church not the church building that's just the building we are the church so we need to do what what the church is supposed to do and we're supposed to pray for one another to spend time in god's presence worship him and read his word and all these things so i hope that you have been having an awesome prayer time when we do these children's church videos and that um great things are happening during those times that you can feel his presence that you are praying over one another and and um that you are seeing beginning beginning to see that god doesn't just do things in the church building he does them everywhere that we go because we are the church um so on this Easter Sunday, let, let's um, let's close in prayer together. I'll, I'll lead us in prayer. Well, I guess, I mean, I guess you can't lead us in prayer because I can't hear you right now. Um, but let's, uh, let's close in prayer. I'll lead us in prayer and then we'll wrap up. Um, so let's close our eyes, bow our heads, and let's talk to God. Father God, I just thank you so much for this day, Lord Jesus. Um, I thank you, God, for this Easter Sunday, Lord, a day to remember what you did for us, God, um, how you rose victorious from the grave, God, from death, Lord Jesus. And um, I just thank you, God, that you sent your son, Jesus, to die on the cross to take the punishment for my sins, Lord. I, I can't thank you enough for that, God. And um, I'm just so thankful for the love that you have for me, God, a love that I can't even understand, Lord, uh, a love that... Uh, you're a God who loves me when I'm broken. You're a God who loves me when I'm hurt. You're a God who loves me when it feels like nobody else loves me, God. And I'm, I'm so thankful for that, Lord Jesus, that the love that you have for us is a never-ending love. And I just ask that you um, help us to remember that, God, as we celebrate this Easter Sunday, Lord Jesus. Help us to remember the, the great love that you have for us, Lord, and help us um, to return that love to you, God, through our worship, God, through reading our word, Lord, through through our time of prayer, God, um, just spending time with you, Lord Jesus. Um, help us to give back uh, the love that you give to us. Let us show it to you, God. Let us show it to others. And um, I thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Alrighty, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed Children's Church today. I know I sure had a great time. I enjoyed Love It or Leave It, and I enjoyed uh, I enjoyed getting to watch Carl do our opening, even though he didn't let Mr. Hunter and I do it. Um, I hope that you guys had a great time with us today, and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your Easter day. I hope you can enjoy it with some of your family. Um, but always remember what Easter is truly about. It's not about the candy or the egg hunts. Those are fun and those are great. I love to do those sorts of things. But remember that Easter is about Jesus and the love that he has for you. So take time to continue today and tomorrow and as the week goes on every day to spend time and love one Jesus too. Um, I guess I will see you guys next week. Bye!